game time. <laughs> We're gonna play a Lord of the Rings Trivial Pursuit. That I'm going to We're very shaky on the rules, so don't blame us. We're just kinda like making it up as we go. That's what the best game is. Um, so I'm gonna explain the rules a little bit to Tad here. Basically, uh, I don't think it matters where, as long as it's like one of these two big ones. I think we can start on either side. At least that's what we're gonna do. We might have to start on the same one. I don't think it really matters since it's two player. Um, land, roll the dice. As far as go back, you can go back either way. It doesn't matter. You don't have to go in a straight line if you don't want to. Um, main object of the thing is to get to the center. We're not going to play with the ring rafe or the ring thing. We're just going to play it like a little bit traditionally, but I'm going to keep him out here just because it's kind of intimidating. Looks cool. Looks sexy, and that's the thing we're going to get to. Um, get to the center. You ask the last question. You get to pick whatever it is you want. I'm assuming you're going to lose. Yeah, uh, probably. Yeah. <laughs> I have no illusions of grandeur I can win this thing. So, uh, we rolled the goat. So you went first. Oh, I guess we can do that now. I don't remember. I, I think won. you won. Yeah, I can still beat that. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Close. So then I will go first. And... Don't we have one of those... Oh, never mind. We put it on the guy, right? Yeah. But... It's supposed to be like 30 seconds per question. Oh, here's our little question box thingy. Yeah, and then if you get all the colors, you can make your way up to the center. Uh, I don't think you lose one for getting a question wrong. At least for us, we're not doing that. We're not going to be. I'd be here all day. Six. Yeah, we don't want. We want this kind of be a quickie, but not too quick. I think you can go up. But you just keep going through. Yeah, you might be right. I'm gonna go around. Six and. Oh, you get. <sighs> I'm already gonna pick out the red. Assuming I'm gonna get it. It's uh the ring. Ring. Ring right. question. Where does Saruman tell Gandalf the nine riders have set out for? Minas Tirith. Minas Tirith. Yeah. Minas Tirith. Thank you. Mm, Megas Minas Morgul. Mogul or Mount Doom. It's Megas Morgul. You are correct, sir. <laughs> Where do Faramir's Mir rangers capture Frodo and Sam? Uh, Osgiliath? 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 Mordor? Or Ephelion? Ephelion? <sighs> like, where they captured him at? Yeah. 
I think maybe it's a filly in. Yep. <laughs> the other two places didn't sound right. I can't pronounce these fucking things, though. So. I probably have a hard time reading them. Uh, green. Or a leaf. Whose last words in the second movie are All our hopes now lie with two little hob hobbits that was a, somewhere in the wilderness. That was Gandalf. Yes. <laughs> Gandalf the White. Man, just says Gandalfs. Gandalfs. Oh, I get to roll. Go again. It's going to be a quick One, game. One, two, three. <laughs> roll again. Brown. Which is the crest. You go, Gandalf. How much money to the nearest million did the Fellowship of the Ring take in on its <laughs> opening weekend in the U.S.? 45, 66, or 87? Oh, God, I really don't know that one. 66, I'm going to guess. Fuck! <laughs> Was it 66? Yeah. <laughs> that sounded right. Oh, I might as well start making my way up the center. Yellow? I don't need a yellow. I think I saw the answer it, though. You kill the sword? Yeah. Where is Where in Moria does the Fellowship make their stand when first attacked by the orcs? East Gate, East, uh, East Gate, Darodelf, or Balin's Tomb? Balin's Tomb? Balin's Tomb? Where in Moria? Read it to me again. Where in Moria does the Fellowship make their stand when first attacked by orcs? East Gate, Darrow Delph, or Balan's Tomb? Balan's Tomb. Yes. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, another brown. Uh, that was like the money question or film question. Which fellowship actor mm -hmm. did coach Bob Anderson say was the best swordsman he ever trained? That was Vigo Mortensen. Yes. I would have <laughs> that one. So I don't think you count the middle. Oh, you don't? Yeah. Blue then. I need a blue anyway, so. How many times does Golem pounce on Frodo when the hobbits ambush him in Emin Mall? Emin Wheel? Emin Mall? Emin Wheel? Meal? M -M -M U I L? Yeah. How many times does he pounce Frodo? Yeah. Pounce on Frodo. Pounce on Frodo. Once? Oh my god, I get a turn. No, it was twice. It was twice? Twice. Oh, okay. <laughs> there you go. Woohoo, I gotta go one time. Get to roll again. Alright. Blue one. Blue one. The. Uh, whatever, harp thing? Or? I think that's, uh, that's, um, an orc sign. Or it might be just like uh, the flame or something. It always looks like teeth to me. Nah, it's something. You oh, I think it's I think it's the white hand Saruman maybe. You need to cover the back of the card up because that's the answer. Then. Oh, I do. Yeah. Oh, I need to pick another one or did you read it. I can't. I didn't yeah, see you it. Can't but... see. Yeah, whatever. I can see. I didn't see what it was though. I wasn't smart enough to look at it. Who was sitting on a small throne next to the main one when Pippin um, advanced at Minas Tirith?
advanced at most here. <laughs> Wait, I might just go. Hold on. Sitting on the throne next to the main throne? Yeah. Uh, are they S? Who was it? You should be able to get that one. Yeah, that was the, uh... I don't remember his name. Actually. Really? Yeah. I know like, the guy who plays him is on Fringe. Yeah, he is. Was it the, uh... The... I don't remember the guy's name. Oh, man, you're... I'm a, I'm not, I don't remember this kind of stuff that well. well. I do, but I don't. It's, um... I'm trying to remember how they, what the title they give him. Was it, like, Vicious? Well, it was Steward. Steward? Yeah. Steward. But they were looking for a name. Steward of Gondor. He was the Steward of Gondor. It was, um... I guess... You can read the question. Since I'm really bad at reading. <laughs> Who sits on the small throne next to the main one when Pippin arrives? Arrives. Okay, arrives. Arrives at Minas Tirith. Oh, I'm horrible at spelling. Reading. That was... Steward of Gondor, whose name do not stay in my head right now. It was, uh... Fucking A. You know, the, like, there's so many comments, it's like... Just in bold letters right now. <laughs> you gotta give up? Yeah, I'm out of time anyway. I can't remember your guy's name. What is it? Denethor. Denethor, alright. Ah, I gotta roll twice. I'm gonna go with green. What two people does Frodo willingly offer the ring to because he thinks them wise? What two people he yes. offers the ring to because he thinks they're wise? One would probably have to be Gandalf the Grey, and the other one would probably have to be uh, Galantriel. You are correct, sir. I don't think he really offered it to Gandalf because he was wise, just because Gandalf, he's like, you know, take it to you, just take the damn fucking ring. <laughs> okay. I have red. Oh, we can't count that. Green? Oh, greens are easy. Go for it. What am I missing? The orange and blue? Oh, I didn't get the blue one last time, that's right. What are you going, you're in green? Who does Aragorn say he and his companions are friends of when first meeting Oromir? Oromir? Okay, read the whole thing back. <laughs> Who does Aragorn say he and his companions are friends of when he first of when first meeting Oromir? Oromir. I believe he said he's friends of friends of Rohan, friends of the North, or friends of Rohan. If I, I'm trying to remember the exact line how I said it. They're looking for a name. Oh, then they're friends of Gandalf. No. Who? Theoden, king of Rohan. Aragorn said he was friends with Theoden. I guess. I don't remember him saying that. But well, okay, whatever. Go ahead. You're. Your roll. <laughs> Three. Let's try a green one. See if I can do one. It was pretty easy. I think they're easy. All right, green wood. What's the name of the Hobbit girl who? What's the name of the Hobbit girl? That Sam is too shy to dance with at Bilbo's party. Oh, it was the name of a flower, wasn't it? Oh my fucking god. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> I don't even know why I put it back. That was stupid of me. Oh god. I don't, Do you know what it is? I know what it is. I put it back, like I put it back, like because I knew the answer. <laughs> I should have left it out just for verification. Was it Lily? Lily? It was Rosie. Rosie. Mm. Rose. Rose. I'm pretty sure it was Rose. I'll take your word for it. I know. I know it has to do with the flower. I know it has to do with the flower. I think you're right. Yeah. It's, I think it's Rose. I oh, know you said Rose. I said Lily.
Yeah. Now I'm kind of regretting putting that back because now I'm not really too sure myself, but I'm almost sure it was Rose. I ain't, I ain't gonna find it. I'm probably wrong anyway. Uh, I might give you. I'll, I'll give you another one since I put it back. I'll, I'll be fair about it. I shouldn't have put it back. Who was the girl? <laughs> <laughs> You got it? Yeah, it was just, com it's really confusing how to say it. How long does Erwin choose to be with Aragorn rather than face the ages without him? One lifetime, one year, or one generation? Lifetime? Yep. You should have got Rosie though. <laughs> I, I'm almost dead certain it's fucking Rosie, but 